Willis and Emily, what can I say even describe you both? You are two of a kind. I cannot think of anyone else that is more perfect than my brother. You two, are, you two just clicked straight away. I remember when this young lady, my mother, told me the first story about meeting Emily, that when I asked about how would it go, she, the first thing she said to me, he's gonna marry that girl. When I first met Emily, 100% agree. I could not find any reason to flaunt her. She was perfect in every way for, her, for him. Marriage is given that husband and wife may comfort and help each other, living faithfully together in need, in plenty, in sorrow and in joy. And it is given that with delight and tenderness they may know each other in love and through the joy of their bodily union may strengthen the union of their hearts and lives. Dad! Come on in! We're delighted to welcome Willis as our son-in-law. He is kind and generous and most importantly clearly lights up Emily's life. We've seen how happy they are together and it's a delight to be in their company. Um, and I think as long as Willis, like us, does what he has told, all will be well for the future. So, you know, what is the secret to a, a good marriage? Uh, a marriage is about having a husband is understanding, sympathetic, supportive and considerate. And in the Langley, clearly, he's going to have one, isn't he? So, as uh, all the Mrs Langleys will know, you're, you're in for a good ride. Uh, sorry, uh, in for a good time. I give you this ring as a sign of our marriage. Willis, I give you this ring as a sign of our marriage. With my body, I honour you. All that I am, I give to you. All that I have, I share with you. Within the love of God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. support and uphold them in their marriage now and in the years to come. Wonderful, right. The only way I can really describe them both together, that they are both like a fine wine. Emily gets better every year, and Willis, you take a little bit longer to mature. To the newlywed couple, 
Chubule, chinamle. Chubule.